Okay, today I will show you how to insert table into Excel and uh, how to get the name, uh, set up the name of the table and also how to list all the tables within the Excel files. So first, let's insert a table. Click one of the cells you want to insert table. Go to Insert, find the table and select if you ha you want headers so select my table has the headers so this one is the headers okay so now you can drag and uh, to select how many columns and uh, rows you want if you want to change the header you just double click it and then you can insert the name do the second one okay so after we uh, <coughs> insert the table let's insert another table same thing okay so after that you want to get a uh, set a name Give it a name of the table. So you just click within the table and then you go to the table design. From here you can you can see this one is a table one. So this one is table two. So let's change the name of the table one to student and uh, table two let's say it's a teacher. Okay, table one, student, table two, teacher. Now let's see if we want to list uh, how many tables within the Excel file. Very simple, you go to the name box and click the drop down. You can see the table list is here. So when you click one of the table list, for example, you want to click student it will automatically select all the student table if you want to go to the teacher table it will automatically show you where it is okay so next video I will talk about how to use in Microsoft 365 for power automate power flow to grab the form information and uh, automatically save it into the table so for example if a user submit a form then we create a power flow to automatically save all the form information to the co uh, to the table Okay, so hope you enjoy this video. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.